Welcome to The Dish LA. I hope you guys had a great weekend. Here are your three topics in three minutes. In some serious news, Netflix original documentary Cheer star Jerry Harris was charged and arrested this week for the production of child pornography. According to CNN, Harris is accused of enticing an underage boy to produce sexual and explicit videos and photos of himself. According to criminal complaint filed in the U.S. District Court of Chicago, Harris appeared in federal court on Thursday afternoon where the government sought his detention as a danger to the community. Harris's teammates and coach finally broke their silence via Instagram to share their thoughts on the situation. Former coach Monica Aldama said, My heart is shattered into a million pieces. I am devastated by the shocking and unexpected news. And former teammate Gabby Butler expressed her feelings saying, Like most of you, I am shocked, dismayed, and deeply saddened by the recent news concerning my friend and former teammate. It was a close call for TikTok this week. The app that we've grown to love over this quarantine was almost taken off the app store this week. No! God, please, no! On Friday, President Trump announced the termination of the app was set for September 20th if he did not approve the proposal with Oracle to purchase the app from the Chinese company. According to Daily Mail, last month Trump ordered that the Chinese technology company ByteDance to sell TikTok or else it would be shut down in the United States. But don't worry TikTokers, no need to dust off your resumes and your business attire. On Saturday, President gave his blessing for the proposal to move forward with the purchase of the dancing app. The Kardashians are back for their final season and we're going to savor it like it's a last sip of a Poosh avocado smoothie. <laughs> This season is filled with tears, relationship struggles, cryptic rumors, and a glimpse into their quarantine life. It kind of sucks that it took a pandemic for me to finally relate to the Kardashians after 14 years. Knowing that they are suffering through a quarantine like all of us made it a little bit easier. I am so sad that they are going off air after 14 years, but hey, good things always have to come to an end, right? Thank you all for watching. Catch me on Wednesday while I dive into all things Emmys with a special guest. Netflix original talk. <clears throat> The president gave his blood. Mm. <laughs> is Scooby here? Uh, yeah. Is Scooby here? Woo! Now from the top, make it what? That's some wet. That's some wet. Make the moon. Pop it. Lock it. Drop it. I'm scared.